Welcome back to What's the 4 and 1. Now, Courtney is bringing us a beauty trend that is flying under the radar, and our executive producer hopes it stays that way. <laughs> <laughs> well, a New York City-based makeup artist, Johanna Adams, is known for her stunningly artistic lip creations on Instagram. Um, she posted her, her latest creation, which are the geode-inspired lips. So cue up the photo, okay? <laughs> when we saw this photo on Instagram, it had over 16.4 thousand um, likes. A lot, a lot. So according to BuzzFeed, the look is created using a combination of heavy glitter, a color base, and a thick, clear lip gloss. Um, you can find more, you know, on social media about this lip trend, but we'd like to hear your thoughts on um, Johanna Adams' Geo Inspired Lip Creation. So hit us up on Facebook and Instagram at What's the 411 TV. Well, I can just say right now, I think it looks gross. I do not like <laughs> it at all. It's definitely interesting. It's, it's something that you would wear, like, for a costume, like on a, you know, theater or some type of movie, like space age type movie. It doesn't look like something you could ever actually wear in the street. Right. Look well, I mean, it looks very know, dramatic. I'm sure that totally, she went to... Um, I'm sorry. Go ahead. Please no, what I was saying is when she I'm probably, sorry. when she created it, she probably went to the extreme, but I'm sure there's a variation of it where it's toned down and you actually could wear it without it looking so Like um, you have rocks boy. on your lips. Yeah. Well, yeah. I would think it looked like you have rocks on your lips. But, you know, it does. What yeah, I find most like, interesting is that um, there have been previous, like, lipstick <laughs> things that women have come up with, with the really dark colors and the light colors, then the eyeshadows, and, you know, these, these I eye eyelashes. I, I mean, they're blowing my mind. So, I mean, what I'm going to say is, like, I'm most of the stuff y'all guys come up with is, like, should be under the radar. <laughs> You're a hater. So you prefer You're a hater. no makeup. I didn't say I prefer no makeup, but I find that most black women are naturally beautiful. So um, I'm not uh, saying that. Ah, nice there's no makeup. Yeah, but, definitely but, nice but, but a little bit. <laughs> but what, I guess what I'm saying is that, you know, this weird stuff comes out. All but, women are naturally beautiful. Did I say black women? Yes, yes I did. Oh, That's okay. Well, you we know, are, we're all descendants of black people, so <laughs> all women are black women. But anyway, <laughs> uh, the point I'm trying to make is that this stuff comes out, and through time, it's embraced, and it becomes part of what women are doing. Right. Well, makeup is supposed to enhance what you already have, um, unless you, you know, are doing a show or, like Kizzy mentioned, you know, a costume party or things like that. So makeup um, definitely is an asset for all women, you know. I'm sure it is. Yeah, absolutely. I wouldn't want that woman around me, though. Oh, I don't Lord. Think she would want to be around you anyway. Exactly. Oh, <laughs> shots fired. <laughs> Look, Onika. Oh, I mean, Courtney. Oh, my. <laughs> I'm just teasing. Right. Right. Yes, I am.